Alright folks, Pitching Ace ED, we are back on Clash Royale, Road to Legendary, Day 19. So, um, for those of you guys who don't know... So, this is my deck right now. Um, changed it up a little bit from the last one. Uh, basically this is, uh, like, go big or go home kind of deck. Ooh, got the Inferno Tower, sweet. This is the Crown Chest for today. So I already grabbed the crown chest. Nice, a lot of royal giants. Never gonna use them, but people always request them. Nice, a lot of spear goblins. I'll take it. A mini P.E.K.K.A. Nice. Another royal giant. Sweet. So let's walk through a couple of these. This guy's got mirror. So let's show me winning one to start off with. So, he actually has a low level hog rider, which is helpful for us. I didn't realize he had mirror, actually. So right here, I basically am trying my best to use the rage to take everything out. And I luckily do. Now at this point, I was thinking of a three crown, but uh, he does... He basically is really trying to uh, to take me out. So I decided to go for a second crown um, instead of a three crown. And right here, huge mistake by me. I did I wasn't able to put the P.E.K.K.A. down before the bomber got a chance to hit. So we're getting close here to the last minute. He basically goes bum rushing. I throw my guys up here because I kind of want to take out his decks. So you'll notice right here we've got 30 seconds left. Basically again, so he, right there, as the first time I thought Hog Rider, he should have done Hog Rider. He, what he should have done probably was was double uh, Elixir his, or double his deck. His Goblin Hut, sorry guys. His Goblin Hut, he really should have gone through twice. So with this one, I don't have an Elixir Collector, so I just have to cycle my cards if I don't get what I want right away. Okay, so... Nice. Perfect. Nice. And he used the uh, Elixir. Nice, come on, three hits. Nice. Three hits. I'll take it. Uh oh. This isn't good. Yep. Uh. Okay, so this is not going very well for us. Come on! Ugh. I hate giant skeletons so much. Well played. Good game. So, we're gonna go, we're gonna have to go for this. We're gonna absorb the damage on the left side. I don't want to do this, but I have to. So much damage we're absorbing right here. Oh, brother. So I haven't seen any air attack from him, really. Yep, so we're gonna just have to take him out really quickly. So, again, we gotta give up a tower.
If we survive this, I'm going to be shocked. Like, legitimately shocked. There's no way that we should be able to uh, survive this. Nope, no way. Yep. <laughs> Good luck, man. That was just unfortunate. You know, I should have done the I should have done the P.E.K.K.A. earlier on, but we got a crown chest or a crown uh, for the crown chest. So again, not the best start for us. We're really gonna want him to uh, to start off. Okay. All right, you play, buddy. Your play. I've legit got a lot of spells. Okay. Oh my goodness, you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, we're screwed. Come on, can you stop him? Nope. I swear, man, this is a, this deck right here is either you, you go big or you go home. And we're going home the last couple times, no joke. So I guess what we're gonna try and do is we are gonna push, try and push down the right tower. Yep, we'll eat it. We'll eat the damage. We'll even give up the tower. survived oh he's got freeze I forgot oh the freeze is brutal he must have just gotten the ice wizard because this is a great push Kidding me, man. All right. Well, GG to this one as well. So we'll try one more game. Um, I may lose. It's so depressing. <sighs> but like I said, man, feast or famine, feast or famine. I will say, although you guys may come back for day 20 and I'm not in Arena 7, this has kept me in Arena 7 for a while. So usually I'll go up against a couple people that I can just steamroll, but that has not been the case so far. I have a much better starting deck, but still not the best. Whenever I don't start off with P.E.K.K.A., it's never usually a good sign. I can't reach him with my Inferno Tower, but I can reach him. So if I can just take out the bomber, I'll be happy. Good trade, good trade. Because my P.E.K.K.A is not gonna be able to get up to the bomber tower in time anyways. I'm wondering if I should throw, yeah. So right now I'm actually okay with what we're doing because I have the bomber and I have the spear goblins, I have arrows. He's basically done with minions though, so I'm pretty sure he's, yep, good on minions. I will uh, make sure that he focuses on... Oh, you gotta be 
kidding me, man? Well played. Well, he's got a minion. He's got a minion horde, so that should be. I mean, hopefully, hopefully, he doesn't play them yet. Okay, good. He doesn't. Yeah, I'm fine with this. All it's it's a little bit of absorb damage, but really, you know, he didn't go minion horde, so minion horde would have pretty much almost taken my tower. He might not have had it up. Or wanted to use that much elixir for it. But we do know he has a bomb tower, so what we're really going to be focusing on is the, uh, really the P.E.K.K.A. push. So all of our guys are going to go way in the back. And, best part about this, we get another P.E.K.K.A. And we can have another Bomber. And he takes me out, you son of a Nutcracker. Oh, we didn't take him out! You gotta be kidding me! He's got Minion Horde. So screwed! Man, where's your minion horde? Wow. He has not been very aggressive with his. There's a minion horde. You know what? I'm actually gonna let that go. That's gonna be a very odd, odd split for him. Nice. 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 We might be able to get this. Oh my gosh. You gotta be kidding me. Oh brother. Can't do it. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna see you guys in day 20. I'm gonna, or I'm gonna see you guys in the next day. I'm gonna wrap this one up. So I'll see you guys in day 20. This has been Pitching Ace 88. Over and out.